everyone, I'm Sarah Kajumka with your political news update for Wednesday, May 25th. While Dominique Strauss-Kahn awaits his trial, the French finance minister is ready to grab the reins at the IMF. Christine Lagarde announced her campaign bid after speaking with both the French president and prime minister. She is 55 years old and will be the first woman to run the fund since it was created in 1946. European countries have already announced their support for her, but leaders from Brazil, Russia, India, China and South Africa say it's time to break the trend that the leader comes from Europe. The selection process will be completed by June 30th. President Obama spoke to the British Parliament today with promises to remain committed to fighting Muslim terrorists and keeping the pressure on Muammar Gaddafi. Obama and Prime Minister David Cameron had a private meeting right before Obama's speech. The president is in the middle of a six-day four-nation trip around Europe. Back home, Democrats came out victorious in yesterday's special election for Western New York. Democrat Kathy Hochul took home a staggering 48 percent of the vote, considering Republicans have held the district for more than four decades. The issue of Medicare turned out to be a major deciding factor in this election. And the United States is imposing sanctions against seven companies who have helped supply Iran with energy power. The State Department says this is meant to slow Tehran's development of nuclear power. And that's your political news update for Wednesday, May 25th. I'm Sarah Kajamko. Check back with RTTnews.com all day for the latest political headlines.